work refers to reality, that it's all, uh, it's much like painting, I suppose, in that I work from scratch, that everything you see is created um, by the artist. And in many ways, I'm confronting the nature of photography and the ways in which we um, think about it and the ways that we approach the world through its influence on us. In many ways, I wanted to uh, <clears throat> break down that sculptural and architectural structure and, and deal more with the picture plane, actually, and deal a little bit more with the senses and the possibilities of an image um, in the end. So I, I, I wanted to break down the structure and push the image more towards a two-dimensional phenomenon. And I <clears throat> felt like I could do that through the use of reflection and uh, using light in a different way, bouncing it off the water, for example, and breaking down the form visually. With the earlier work, it was more obvious that they were constructed of paper and cardboard and uh, sometimes real objects like cloth or a, a real fan or a real fork. Um, so you could see the contrast in material and the contrast in scale. I'm an American artist, and uh, I uh, have been building things that I photographed for the last 40 years, really, and this is really a survey of that work <clears throat> from 1975 to uh, the present. It's kind of like being in the House der Kunst. You know, it's such an incredible building. It's such a great space for art. And, um, but to deal with it, you, you kind of have to <laughs> deal with the past a little bit. So as an artist, I wanted to deal with that, you know, the origins of the structure and incorporate it into the exhibition. So when Oakley asked me to do something in the stairwell, that's what I wanted to look at. You know, the choice of flags was really in an effort to refer to the sense of spectacle and, um, you know, the understanding, the very sophisticated understanding of propaganda and uh, its relationship to art. I didn't want to make beautiful objects for the sake of beauty. I wanted to do something useful in the world and, you know, change the world and have an impact on the world. And, and uh, so <clears throat> that was kind of a core belief that you know, art had to have a use, it had to have a purpose. <laughs> 